Hi guys, welcome back. Today I have another demo for you. This is one of the demos I got to play during the Next Fest on Steam. I have never heard of this game before, but it's definitely up my alley. Red Dead Redemption 2 is probably my favorite game of all time. So it's Cowboy Life Simulator. It's by Rock Game SA. And I'm, I'm super excited to see what it's about. So let's get right into it. Oh, I like this music. All right, hopefully this one is better than the horse shelter game. That was quite disappointing. Oh, nice rugged man. Hey partner, it's been a long time. I'm glad you're back. All your belongings are in the cart. Let's see what your uncle has left for you. Well, this is it. It ain't much because your uncle tried to find luck at the bottom of the bottle. I promised your uncle that I'd help you find your first steps on the ranch. I can show you how to make the ranch work like clockwork. Of course, if you want to learn by yourself, go ahead. Okay, so WASD. Can jump? Well, that's nice. Keep an eye on your statistics. On the left, you can see health, hunger, thirst, and stamina. Oh, okay, so you have to eat and drink. Awesome. Hopefully they don't go down too fast because that could be a nuisance. Water will help you with dehydration. Western conditions are tough. Well, that's true. Oh wow, I'm like a interesting looking fellow. Okay. You know, you can take my old nag as well. He's probably off to graze on your grass. Oh, so I get my horse. Okay, let's call him, oh, an apple. I'll grab an apple, that'll probably come in use later. Is that a cactus? Okay. Come here, horse. My old nag. You need to gallop on the horse by pushing E. Okay. Where you at? Oh, there you are. Oh, he's got those crazy eyes. Jeez. Like a hell horse. <laughs> I wonder if I can save. Oh, look, I can. That's relieving. Especially because on Horse Shelter, there was no save state. And if you saw my last video, you know exactly what happened there. So, I'll save real quick. Okay, so I gotta give you a name. The gray coat reminds me of like Storm Cloud, so we'll go with Stormy. Awesome. He has an inventory, okay. Nice. I feel like I'm sitting a little bit low. Oh, that's fun though. I like the way his ears go back when he runs. Okay, not too bad. All right, demolish some building. Oh, so there's like building and stuff too. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so we'll just, uh, we got a hammer and demolish. Wait. How does this work? Um, nothing's happening. <clears throat> nothing's happening. Okay, so I spent probably three minutes figuring this out, but you have to actually bring up the menu, take it over, and click to make it demolish. It's really strange. I find that a little bit confusing. I think that that could be optimized a little better. But anyway. Okay, so now we're going to build something. All right. Oh, look at all these different things you can build. Wow. You could build like a whole little community. 
Oh, and there's animals. <gasps> I'm really liking this. Okay, so we need to build a well, it looks like. Okay, where's a good spot for a well? Probably like right here in this corner, huh? Yeah, it's easily accessible. Okay, you can't use this functionality until you finish it. Oh, so we actually have to build it. Okay. So just hammer it or is it a weird menu again? Oh, there we go. Oh, our nice little whale. Okay, look at all the trees around. Okay. Oh, I really like this. This is really neat that you can freely build. So now we're going to grab an axe. Oh, it's a pickaxe too. Oh, I guess too early for that. Okay. So now what? Where's my old nag? Get me over there. Hey, Stormy. Let's go. Oh, this is kind of cool. Okay, so we get to chop some trees. Gotta bring out my axe. Get closer, maybe? There we go. Uh, gotta maneuver? How, how does this... Oh, there we go. Okay, timber! Oh, and then convenient little logs. You have a wood now. <laughs> oh, really? Remember that you can use your hammer. Ah, my dog's barking. Sorry about that. He's a tough guy. Okay, so we're going to build a sawmill or lumber mill. I wonder where's a good spot for this. That's as good as any, I guess. Oh, now I feel like it's backwards. Oh well, that's okay. Alright, we've got a functioning lumber mill. Okay, and we're going to create wood boards, which I'm assuming will be used to build more structures. Okay, so how do we do this? Do I put it in... in the uh, inventory of the machine? Is that what this is? Okay, nothing. Um... I'm so confused. I'm not exactly sure how to make this work. Is there like another section I need to click or... I mean, this is the storage. Okay, so I did a quick cut. I took a bit to figure it out, but I needed to put it in my inventory, then click this, and now it is actually creating. So the storage down below is where the finished product goes. There's nowhere to put the wood into the machine itself. It comes directly from your inventory. Once again, a little bit confusing, Kind of like the demolishing thing. I think that this could have a little bit... Uh, unless it's just me. Maybe I'm just... You know. I don't know. I feel like it could be better. We can mine as well. Okay, so we're going to have ore. Gold, silver. Awesome. Grab our nag. And head on over... 
and grab some ore. Oh no, we get our pickaxe first. That's right. So now we can grab our pickaxe. Now we're going to go grab some ore. This, so far, is leaps and bounds better than the last demo I played. Dang, this horse can just leap over everything. All right, so here's some iron. Mine some chunks off of that. Okay, now a blacksmith. Oh, this is so fun. Let's stick it right here. Well, like right there, that looks good. What, I don't have enough resources? Do I need more iron? Okay, we we'll grab some of this. What do I need? Oh, wood board. I didn't get the boards out of the inventory of the lumber mill. <laughs> Oops. Okay, now we're back and we have our boards. Gotta get it positioned perfectly because I don't think you can move it once it's down. There we go. Nice and out of the way. And now let's build it up. As you guys know, I really love these games where you can mine resources, build, survive. And this is, you're doing that, but you're also a cowboy. Like, what more could you ask for, right? Okay, so we're gonna build ourselves a house. So we need some nails. I wonder how many nails we need to build a house. It's probably a lot, right? I mean, a whole house. I'm trying to figure out how to interact with this thing. Oh, here we go. Um, I still don't have any iron, but I mined two nodes. Let's see. I guess it's not directly going into my inventory. I can't pick that up. Oh, these chunks. Okay, so all those other ones I mined are just kind of lying around. All right. I don't know how much we need, but it's a good start. All right, make some nails. Oh, so the ore is already ingots? That's kind of disappointing. There's no smelter then. I like to turn the, the raw resources into something that you can use, but. All right, so how many nails? Looks like we need 20. 20 for a whole house? It's gonna be a tiny house. Oh, and you make 10 per. Okay, so we need to do this one more time. Okay, that's enough nails. It's gonna be the smallest house ever, I guess. <laughs> Only needing 20 nails. I need to pick up some more wood real quick. We got our nails. Let's go Stormy. This horse is fast. 
Look how fast I go over this terrain. We've got enough nails, but we need more wood logs. So I'll just grab a few logs. So we need to go back to our ranch and build our house there. And I just have to say, I absolutely love this background music. That is great. Convenient how it just goes into individ individualized little pieces. Do I have enough now? Yes, I do. Okay, now we can head back to the ranch to build our cute little house. Where is the ranch? Where are we? Um. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay. So that's my ranch. Oh, fast travel. Very nice. Okay, and here we are back at home. Love this. See, this is a game I could see myself getting at launch. This game seems finished. Oh, it looks like my well should have been built right here. Where did, oh, it's right, that's ah, close enough, it's fine. So it looks like this is our old house. We'll get rid of some of these pieces. But yeah, this game seems like a game that's about to be released. So far, I haven't really seen many bugs. It, the mechanics seem really good. I do wish that there were some ways to break down the resources like the ore, a smelter. That extra step is just, I don't know, there's something satisfying about it. But it's a little gripe. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, I'll clear more of this out. Graphically, it's really beautiful too. And the background sounds, the music's really good. Just a few gripes, you know, about the menus. Some of it's kind of confusing, but... So far, I'm really, really enjoying this game. Okay, got a nice cleared out space here. And these boards look like a good place to start. So we'll do this small house. Hey, it's not too small. Only 20 nails for all this, huh? Got a little porch. Okay. Nice, nice. Let me get this other wall built here. Okay. Now the inside. It's kind of weird that it doesn't show like the materials you're using besides wood logs. Oh, little oh look how cute this is. It's so quaint. It looks so cozy. I love this porch. I wonder what the medium and big house look like. If the little one is this nice. Night is approaching. Remember to take a rest after a hard working day. Okay, so we need a bed. All these cool little things to build. All right, furniture, bed. Wow, it really is a tiny little bed. Let's see, we can stick it in the corner over here. Maybe, maybe not. Over by the furnace, 
I don't know what else I can build. I don't I wanna leave myself room. Guess we'll just go right here. Since you move further, you will be able to buy a new blueprints. Okay. Unlock more stuff. All right, we've got our lumpy bed all built. Doesn't look super comfy. That thunderstorm though. Whoa, you see that lightning? And where's my door? I guess I just don't have a door, okay. All right, so now we're gonna have a garden. We get to garden stuff too? Once your building panel is like the garden category. Arable land. So we get to build a garden plot. This is... Wow. I am... I'm impressed. So do I just dig? Is that how I make my garden plot? I don't think this is doing anything. Okay, so once again, I had to take some time to figure this out. And it's actually right here. So you build the land. Same as any other structure. We'll do a bigger plot at first. That's yeah, as good a spot as any. Okay, so now we use the shovel to dig it. I don't know. If any of you, if you played this, did you have a hard time figuring out how to do these different things, or is it just me? Okay, so now we need these seeds. We get an apple seed. And a cabbage seed. And now to plant it. Dig a hole. No. I use the seed. No. <sighs> it's gonna be another one of those things I have to figure out. <laughs> Um, do I have to put it on my hot bar? Okay, that's doing nothing. And I don't think that this digging is doing anything either. Okay, I skipped forward. I don't know how to plant it. So I'm just going to try with the apple seed, build an orchard. And maybe somehow I'll be able to figure it out. So here's the orchard. There's no place to interact with it that I can see. So once again, I had to skip forward, had to figure out how to plant these seeds. It's in the build menu, just like the buildings. You build the plant, the seed. It's strange. So, so far my only gripe with this game is this kind of stuff. That's confusing. Why would you use a build menu to use your seed to plant it? That doesn't make sense. But anyway. Okay, so now we can water the plants. Oh, it's got its own little stats. So it's drying out right now. Just grab this fertilizer. So you can add a fertilizer to plants that have enough water. You can build a composter that will allow you to create compost, which you can then add to plants. Okay. 
So I guess let's give it full water. It's kind of shooting off to the side there, but it looks like it's getting it wet, so. I like that you have to water the plants and take care of them and they have their stats. Okay, fully watered. Now let's take care of our little apple tree. Oh wow, look, you can see it growing in real time. It's slowly getting bigger. You see that? I guess I never have to refill my bucket. It's just endlessly full of water. Yeah, it's definitely growing. Let's try out the fertilizer. I'll just pour it on there. All right, grow, cabbage grow. And now for you, little apple tree. Okay, all ready to go. Can I put this down? Nah, whatever, I'll just take it with me. Okay, nag. Or stormy, sorry, that's offensive. Jeez, I'm just leaping over huge amounts of land. Just tearing through here. If I had it my way, I probably wouldn't make it quite so... Ooh, a fast travel train spot. And there's people. Where'd they go? I need to talk to you. Where'd you go? Oh, here's one. A merchant. Ooh, he's got guns. A rifle, handgun, dynamite. Interesting. What about you? Some gardening tools. All right. And what about you? Bunch of seeds. Okay. Well, let's keep going. And we get to get our first animal! Yay! Animals always make me so happy. What will it be? First time I see the owner of this barn. It looks messy. Since I am your neighbor, I want to give you a gift. Okay. Take this dog. A dog?! I hope you will help you out with your ranch. Oh, how fun! Great, you ordered an animal. It will be delivered soon to your farm. Take care of it and build a shelter. Oh, I get to build him a shelter? Where is... Oh, there's a dog! This is your animal. It needs shelter, but before we build it... Oh, He's so cute! So I can ask it to follow me? Structure, we place it in the middle of the farm and be vulnerable to bandits. Well, we don't want that, do we? He's so cute. How come he's not following me, though? So, it's on the follow me command. So he should just be following me, you would think. All right, he needs a house, so we'll do that real quick. A dog house. And we'll put it over here next to my house. That looks good. Okay, where's my hammer? Why can't I get my hammer out? Oh, I'm like stuck on this dog menu. Where'd he go? And how do I get off of this menu? Oh, there he is. Um, I'm kind of done with your menu now. 
maybe five, but without let him go, I don't want to let him go. I don't know how to get off this menu. I guess free animal quit. But if that like releases him, I'll be so sad. I don't know how else to do it though, so. I uh, can't reach. Can I bend down? Left control maybe? Yeah, there we go. Okay, there's your nice little dog house. Tame him. I thought he was tame. Did he leave since I did that quit thing? I hope I didn't let him go. I wanted to keep him. So I can feed him raw meat. Okay. Where? Oh, oh, he's just kind of standing into the building. I'm glad he didn't leave, though. Oh, look! Now he's in there! It looks really good graphically. That looks like a real German Shepherd. Aww. I love that you get a dog. I wonder if he'll actually follow me around, though. It seems kind of wonky. Gotta talk to you again? I know they took your rifle when they pardoned you, but the Wild West is a dangerous place. Take this old revolver. Ooh, I get to go shoot stuff. You're the only one. Yeah, I own this barn. Okay, so let's try out the shooting. Where is my gun? Okay. So just put it down here somewhere. We'll stick it right here. All right, let's try and fire. Uh, it's not loaded. How do I load it? Mm, nice gun, nice gun. So here's the bullets. Okay, there's gotta be a faster way to do that. There's no way you have to go into your inventory every time. Well, let's just try and shoot it. Ooh. Nice. Feels pretty good. Whoops. Not the best shot, clearly. Oh, R. Okay. So there is a faster way to reload. There we go. Thank you, sir. Not bad for the first time. I agree. Your farm was attacked. My farm was attacked? What? Where are you, Nag? We need to get home as fast as possible. Come on, Stormy. Let's go. Quick, quick, quick. And just plow through all... Ugh, I'm stuck. Jump. Okay. I hope our doggy's okay. Whoa! Don't want to fly off a cliff. Run, 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 run! What the heck kind of wild animal could be attacking my farm? Like a bear or something? Oof. Okay. I hope the dog is okay. That's my main concern. But- oh, a boar? I can't shoot from my horse's back, I guess. Okay. Come here, you boar. Now, why is that guy just standing there? There we go. Ooh, can I skin him? A horse racing event. Oh, okay. Nice. I do wish there was a skinning mechanic. Just another small complaint. Like in Red Dead, when you can skin the animal. I really like that touch. 
Thank you for playing. Expand your farm and become the most wealthy farmer in the West. Oh yeah, I haven't eaten something this whole time. And where's this horse race? You can buy horses. There's my mine. The animal cellar. I don't see it. There's the train station. Oh, you can hire rangers to protect your farm. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we'll go over there. But first I need to eat my apple. The food and water does not decay very fast, which is really good because I respect having that mechanic, but when it's just constantly going down and you have to just be eating all the time, it's just not, not fun. So this is good. Before I go, let's get some water. There we go. Okay, let's go see what this horse race has to offer. Just plowing right through this terrain. It's like ridiculously fast. I kind of wish there was a third person mode. When it comes to horseback riding, I like to be able to see the horse actually run. But as far as first person goes, this isn't bad. Oh, cliff. Okay. So what's this? I want that guitar. Can't take it. Okay. Got to find a way down. I wonder if I could just slowly... Oh, oh, oh no, I don't want to die. Oh my gosh. Okay, this, this is weird. It's working. All right, that's one way to do it. Yeah, that probably shouldn't have been able to happen. Just kind of barrel down the mountainside. Okay, so we've got like a whole event going on here. I know Stormy can take them on. Welcome, Ranger. You look like someone who wants to earn some money. Of course. Horse event. Okay, for best riders. You interested? Yes. What? $500? Ugh, dang. Okay, well, so much for that. Sorry, Stormy, not today. I wonder... I guess we could go check out the animal trader. See what other animals there are available. That would be kind of fun. So, let's see. Where was that animal trader at? Oh, right here. Okay, so we'll just fast travel back to the ranch and then head over there and see what options there are. A chicken. Aw, they're so cute. Okay, so we'll go back to the ranch and see the chickens. Or chicken, I don't know how many there are. I really like this fast travel though, that's cool. Okay, so where would my chicken be? I don't have a coop or anything that I know of. Mm, they 
Maybe it's out near the farm? There's my dog. Oh, there's the chicken. He's just hanging out with the dog. Hey, puppy. Okay, so a chicken coop. Hey, we've already got the materials too. That's convenient. So yeah, for now we'll just go with the smaller one. And I don't want it by my house. So I'll put it back here. Kind of on the property line. That looks like a good spot. So we'll build our chicken. His chicken coop. Or her, I should say. Wow, I really like the buildings in this. Okay, so he's got to, or she has to eat wheat or chicken feed. Where you at, chicken? You gotta go home. So we'll assign animal to the structure, the chicken coop. Okay, so I'm assuming she's in there now. And why are you just out? It keeps telling me to tame him, but I already did. The animal mechanics are a little bit strange. They don't seem quite finished. Well, I can give him some food. Can I rename him or anything? I'm just dog. Dog's your name. I don't really see an option. Yeah, I feel like this needs a little bit more work. I love the premise, though. I love the idea. It just doesn't seem like it's quite polished. Yeah, I don't see any way to name him or do anything, really, so... Let's go see our chicken in her new house. Aw, looking all cozy, although looking quite lonely. So I wonder if she'll lay eggs that I can sell. But I probably have to feed her. And then my cabbage. Almost grown. Give it some more water. So, while I do this watering, my final thoughts on the game are, I will be buying it at launch. I think it's finished enough to be an early access game. It's acceptable. The animal mechanics need work. They don't seem done. You should be able to name your dog. Unless you can, maybe there's like a name tag feature or something I don't know about. And then when you tell it to follow you, it doesn't follow you. And then you assign it to the house and it just is kind of wild again. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Um, I wish that there were more, um, breaking down of the, like the ore thing. I mentioned that earlier, smelting it down, adding that feature, I think would be better. Graphically, it's beautiful. I wish there was more horse care involved. I would love to have a more in-depth horse care game when it comes to these Western style games, because I mean, think about it. Your horse was your main way of transportation. You would have to take really good care of them, take care of their feet, take care of their food, grooming them. It would make a lot of sense for these games to pick up on that more. So that's a complaint. Um, the menu, the building menu. The planting through the building menu is weird. It doesn't feel right. And then the way that you had to demolish with the clicking and all that, like, I don't know, I'm not a big fan. Overall, though, love what they're doing. I think that they've done a really good job. I'm surprised I didn't hear about this game before, honestly. I'm really happy I got to try it out, though. And I could see myself playing this demo some more. Expanding my ranch, putting down more things to grow, getting some money, and eventually trying that horse race out. I don't know. If, if you guys would like to see me do that, let me know, and I will absolutely play it some more. But as of right now... Yeah, I think this is going to go on my wish list, and I will be purchasing it 
when it launches. So thank you guys so, so much for watching as always. Please like the video if you enjoyed this. Comment down below. I'd love to chat with you. Um, share it if you know somebody else that might enjoy this video. And subscribe for more content like this. Thanks so much again. Until next time. Bye, guys.